Hey guys, what's going on? It's Janky, and in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make custom like stream overlays and stuff like that, such as like webcam overlays and like just like putting like your name on the top of the screen and like, other stuff like that on Pixlr E, which is a free uh, photo editing software. So you guys, uh, also if you guys join my Discord, uh, I take submissions for my next uh, logo remaking video right now. So if you guys want to, make sure you guys send in your submissions. Discord link is in the description. And uh, please, if you guys enjoy this video or it helps you guys out. Please like and subscribe but anyway let's get right into the video so uh, basically uh, step one is you guys want to go to this website called pixlr.com slash e and then you guys want to click on full HD right here um, and then click create and if you guys are right here uh, what you guys want to do is um, you guys want to start by making your like outlines so you guys want to click onto the uh, shape icon rectangle and then turn off the fill and then make this is uh and then make the stroke pretty big. This is like the thickness of how much it's gonna be. I would recommend going at around 15 to start, and then uh, just make it just like this. Now there is two ways you guys can do this. You guys can make this just like a thin line, or you guys can keep adding thickness to it. Uh, but yeah, now uh, this part is optional. You guys can add in like a bottom, like a thicker bottom part, just like this. So you guys can add in like your name in the middle and like your socials in the side. So this is what I'm talking about, guys. For instance doing something like this and I'm just gonna be doing it like this like you guys can go as big as you want and then uh, yeah alright guys I decided to make it a little bit thicker to uh, for my next point that I'm gonna be bringing up so um, if you guys go up to here the first way to change color is if it's thinner you guys can actually do inner glow which is the easier way and then you guys can uh, turn it all the way up and then change the color of it but as you guys can see since mine's thicker it um the bottom right here is like not showing so sometimes it will work and you guys will be able to change the color but if it doesn't I have a backup plan you guys can go to adjustment color lookup and then if you guys look at a bunch of different of these there's tons of different colors and uh, you guys can also like click on these things and like change the colors around and stuff like that uh, let's say I want to do like that but yeah that is uh, pretty much how you guys can like change uh, these different things but yeah guys, I think I am just going to stick with the normal default white, but that's how you guys basically change the color for every situation. Now the next thing you guys need to do is uh, add in your text. So at, go to the text icon, and then click add, and then put in your name. And then once you guys do that, you guys can do outline, uh, change the color, whatever you guys want, shadow, background. Uh, there's tons of different things that you guys can do. You guys can also add in like line space, letter space, uh, there's tons of different things you can make it larger but since it's just like a tutorial I'm just gonna keep it like this so if you guys want to add socials down here as well uh, all you guys have to do is go up to here and search up like for instance Twitter logo PNG and then you guys can um, find PNGs by looking for images with the checkerboard pattern some of these images will appear to have a checkerboard pattern here uh, but they won't actually be PNGs, so you guys want to look for the ones uh, just like this first one that shows up. And then, uh, as you guys can see, if you click on it, it'll have the checkerboard pattern. And then copy image address, and then go to layer, add URL as layer, and then paste it in. And there you guys go. If you guys click right here, you guys can make it smaller, and then move it like just like there. So yeah. And then after that, you guys can add in just like your uh, text for like your um, name and for like your Twitter name, or you guys can go like Instagram or whatever you guys went over there. But yeah, guys. Uh, so the next step is if you guys wanted to add like, for instance, I know during Christmas time it's a very popular thing to add in like Christmas lights and stuff. So if you guys wanted to add those, it's the same as the Twitter logo. I'll just show you guys an as, as an example. Uh, Christmas lights, PNG images, and then you guys just choose one. For instance, I'm just gonna choose this one. And you guys are gonna copy image address layer add URL and then paste it in and there you guys go now if you guys just make it smaller uh, you guys can put it along your banner just like this and yeah and you guys can just duplicate it and add in it all over uh, you guys can add in like anything like lightning anything you guys want um, to your banner uh, so yeah that is basically how you guys add, make a face cam overlay completely custom and stuff like that 
But I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make the second thing now, which is basically uh, how some people have like their name like up on like, the top of the screen. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. So if you guys go to new image, full HD image, and then uh, the first step is uh, by going over to the shape icon again, going to line, and then make the stroke pretty large. What you guys want to do is uh, just make a thing just like this. And if you guys mess up, just click Control Z. By the way, guys, um, that's the that is the undo button. Yeah, guys. And also, whenever you guys finish with this, to center it up good, click this button right here, this uh, arrange tool, and then it will auto center itself for you. So yeah. And then just like last time, you just add your text by clicking the text icon, put in the text. You guys can change the styles and everything and then just center it right on up here and yeah you guys can add in socials just like i showed you guys how to add in like those pngs and stuff by putting them like this side and this side you guys can add anything you guys want um so yeah anyway um i hope this video helped you guys out with making some stream overlays if it did make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe to this channel this took me like five tries so uh, i'd appreciate it so much if you guys leave a like and comment down below uh, any video ideas and stuff like that for me to do um and yeah i hope you guys all have a great rest of your guys's day stay safe and uh yes yeah, you guys in the next video